So in this video, we're going to find the gradient of this multivariable function at the point uh, 3, 5. Solution. So the gradient of f is simply the vector where each component is a partial derivative. Uh, we can use standard unit vector notation or we can use component form. Let's, um, let's use component form. So this is going to be f sub x comma f sub y. That's going to be the gradient. So in this case, the partial with respect to x is simply 2, because all of the other variables, in particular y, it's constant. So all of this is 0 when you take the derivative. So you just get 2. And in this case, the partial with respect to y, uh, well, this is 0 and this is 0, so this is a y. Right? Because 2 times 4 is 8. So that's uh, the gradient of f. Okay. And now we just have to plug in the numbers. So the gradient at 3, comma 5, well, that's just 2. And then uh, y is 5, so 8 times, eight times 5 is uh, 40. So that is the gradient vector. So what does this mean, like intuitively? So at the point 3, 5, this function f increases most rapidly in the direction of this vector. Again, at the point 3, 5, the function f in increases as fast as possible in the direction of this vector. Right? So if f travels in the direction of this vector at 3, 5, it will increase most rapidly. So I hope that made sense. 